The Warren Easton Eagles missed out on their third straight state championship game in 2020 after losing to Edna Carr in the semifinal round of the Class 4A playoffs. This fall, a hungry Eagles team returns 10 starters, including junior quarterback Kedrick Connolly. He did pretty good last year, being that it was his first year as a true starter, um, but he, have, he has a year under his belt now, um, and we really counted on him to run the offense, so hopefully he takes a huge leap. We've been working real hard this summer, and in the spring, and he's been getting better. Head coach Jerry Phillips says Connolly has help with a stable of talented backs and electric playmakers like Leon Eloy. They're going to take a lot of slack off him. We're going to run the ball a lot this year, you know, until he really get his feet under him and understand what we're trying to do on offense. And, you know, like you said, we have Eloy. Um, he can go deep. He's going to touch the ball a lot this year, you know, in the backfield. Get it to him fast and let him do let him do his thing. Defensively, Warren Easton returns a plethora of experience from the defensive line to the secondary. Ronald Lewis is going to be good for us. Um, our sophomore corner, um, Wallace Foster, um, my two linebackers, Jare Johnson and Johnny Taylor, <laughs> pretty good. Um, and our D line is going to be solid also. And we have Raynell Root, who's a four-year starter who's going to anchor that, and Jeremiah Macklin, who came on real strong last year. So the whole defense is going to pretty, be pretty good this year. A tough road schedule awaits the Eagles, but one that will have them ready for another deep playoff run in 2021. We start off in Navarre, Florida, who's a 6A team, uh, week one. Then we go to Baton Rouge three weeks in a row. Uh, we have to play Woodlawn, Catholic of Baton Rouge, and Scotlandville, who are three really good teams. You know, we have Edna Carr week six. A game that never disappoints and one that ultimately decides the fate of District 10-4A. Richie Mills, WGNO Sports.